What is up guys, today I'm going to show you how to integrate the lighting effects on your Razer Black Widow Chroma with the Dota 2 game. Okay, so first off what you got to do is open your web browser and search for this software called Razer Game Dog. Uh, it's just called Game Dog but we're putting the word Razer so that it's easier to find. And this is the website you need to go to, insider.razorzone.com. Open it. Scroll down and click over here to download the game doc software. And by the way, this is developed by Wolf Spirit M. Wow, that's one angry wolf. <laughs> but anyways, go ahead and download the software and install it on your computer. Now, part number two. Open up Razer Synapse software and go to Chroma Apps and make sure that the Chroma App integration is enabled because if this is not enabled the software will not work so that's all you need to do in the uh, Razer Snap software and we can close this safely now now we're gonna launch the game dog application uh, you can see it, it appears in recently installed if you can't find it just search it over here and we're in click on games and make sure Dota 2 appears over here and you can customize different colors you can change the key allocations I've already customized it to my taste customize the background color and I'm gonna leave it like just like that you can leave it default but it takes a while for you to get used to this application and change each and individual keys but I suggest you guys if you guys are not experienced just leave it default uh, it's good enough and make sure the Dota 2 folder points out to the points correctly to your steam installation it's correctly pointing to my steam installation here so we're gonna leave it just like that and now we're going to launch Dota 2 okay so now I'm gonna go ahead and create a lobby Let's start the game. You can see it's already taking effect. The light has changed. So I'm going to pick Razor. Yeah, indeed, you get the edge with this keyboard. Anyways, uh, this is your mana. This is your health. This shows whether you're hexed or you're magically immune. And this show this is your day and night counter. And let me just level up here a bit. So as I level up these skills, the light here should change. And by the way, you can customize this color, so that's changeable if you want to. Let's just get a little bit more gold. So it's already counting down over here so let me get my boots and again you can also customize this and I think I should turn this light off so you guys can see it better so as I'm purchasing items over here uh, since it's linked to the X key it's gonna, it's gonna show there and you guys can see the daylight counter has started so when it's day, it's going to be yellow, when it's going to be night, it's going to be blue, and you can, you can also change that, change the color. So check this out guys, so once if I press this, it's going to change the color. So it shows it's under cooldown now, same with the Razor's first, first skill. This is a neat little effect. So if I purchase a blacking bar and activate it, 
uh, you guys can see this will change so it shows that you're magically immune yeah nice little effect there so let me just show you this again cool so this will automatically go back to the uh, blue color once the cooldown has uh, finished and let me just go and attack someone and the last hits will show up over here because I've configured it for this keys so let's show you So yeah guys I think that's about it, uh, hope you guys get an idea and you guys can totally customize each and every color, each and every effect on this keyboard and yeah it's pretty nice. So let me show you the health counter, so if I just stand over here, as my health goes down, uh, the lights, the color of the lights will change the F4 has turned off so you guys can see it's as my health is going down this will change and same goes for mana you can see this is the color is also changing over here So yeah guys, I thank you guys for watching and yeah, do stay tuned for more videos like these. Alright guys, see you guys later.